Hi, hello. Uh, in the previous video, we tried 5 by 5 magic square by using numbers from 1 to 50, only odd numbers. But in this video, we are trying with even numbers from 1 to 50. Okay, for that, we have to extend our 5 by 5 magic square with 25 boxes to 41 boxes like every side we are extending extra four boxes first of all three then one like this in this pattern okay now we will write the even numbers from 2 to 50 or 1 to 50 only even numbers from left side in a diagonal pattern or diagonal manner so 2 4 6 8 next 10 again so next corner line not that inner one from the next corner line 12 extend the numbers 14 16 18 20 okay again uh, from the below line we have to write the next numbers 22 24 26 28 30 next again from this line 32, 34, 36, 38, 40, next 42, 44, 46, 48 and 50. Now what we are going to do is just take the numbers from that extended boxes that 16 extended boxes and we will uh, fill it in the 5 by 5 magic square actual 5 by 5 magic square. So first of all from the left side take this two and try to write that two in between the 26 and 38 that means in the actual magic square. Okay, next 4 in between the 28 and 40, 12 exactly opposite, opposite side of the 5 by 5 magic square. Okay, again from right side also we are trying to write the central box in the center position and sides in the side positions of the magic square, 5 by 5 magic square. Again we are doing the same for upside and downside of the extended boxes of magic square okay again we are trying to write like that so downside to upside and upside to downside and when we compare the magic square of uh, odd numbers to this even numbers this is very easy now the magic square is completed with this uh, 1 to 50 even numbers only so for the clarity i copied the same numbers from this paper to another paper only for the magic square for the clarity purpose i copied the numbers so now we will check it out now if we calculate the columns so first column that means five boxes of the first column the sum will be 130 again the five boxes of the second column will also be that sum will also be 130 and again the third column sum that means five boxes of the third column will also be 130 and fourth column boxes sum will also be 130 and fifth column sum also will be 130 again we will calculate the rows the first row total will be 130 and second row total will be 130 and third row total will also be 130 again fourth row and fifth row sum will also be 130 again if we check the diagonal positions also that sum will also be 130 so now if we take the extreme center of this 5 by 5 magic square that is 26 so if we will add the corners of the magic square with this extreme center that is 26 then also we will get the sum that is 130 and if we calculate this extreme center with the centers of the external square that is 18 38 34 and 14 with extreme center that is 26 then also we will get the total 130 
and if we calculate this 8 20 32 and 44 with 26 that is extreme center then also the total will be same 130 and again if we calculate this 44 48 12 with the extreme center that is 26 then also the total will be only 130 and now if we calculate the inner square centers that is 42 to 50 10 with 26 then also we will get the same total that is 130 and again if we calculate the corners of this inner square that is 16 28 24 36 with extreme center that is 26 then also we will get the same total that is 130 and if you like the video please do like the video and subscribe krishna's diaries thank you for watching